Alright, so here we are, and this is the the final, um, what I did here. So I got a cloth, and then I melt, I have an animated melt on it, um, and you know, that kind of looks cool, and then I smooth it out, and then I do a push, and you know, just, you know, kind of like creative stuff, and you know, see what you can, uh, you know, that kind of looks like guts on the floor, that's kind of cool. Um, and then the animated uh, iterations on the relax, um, and that just kind of smooths smooths it out. So, you know, I can probably dial this down a little bit, see what detail we get in there. Just uh, smooths it out a little bit. So that's what we have. So I'm gonna toggle off these and. Um, so, you know, the melt was just kind of like to sink it to the ground a little bit. Um, I remember this was the first modifier I found in 3D Studio 3, and I thought it was the coolest shit. Um, Alright, so now that we're here, let's put um, the particle system in. So, uh, let's throw down TP and uh, pour in some particles. And use a matter waves. Nope. And let's pick. Uh, let's just pick the object. Oh, we gotta go to the modify panel. So pick object based emitter. We got this guy. And um, melt. So now that we got that, I'm gonna go to melt, and we have a we have our material. That's this, so this is the important part. So we got this guy. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put that on um, the emission. Use material on emit. So use that. Drag this here. Uh, make an instance of it. So this will be the emission map. And so what does this give us? There's some particles coming out. So what I'm going to do is I want more. So I'm going to go uh, 100 by 100, um, random on the face. And I'm going to go per emitter and per activation and a pistol shot of one. Um, and so as the map moves down, we have a... So let's see what I got there. Um, oh, that's slow. I just put the emitters up to a thousand. Um, so dialed those out. Oh, okay, so I guess we do need per emitter. Um, per emitter, and I should move this up here. Per. So let's see. Let's do one per emitter and per emitter activation. So when emitter is born, you know, there we go. Yeah, so that's like a hundred. So wherever the white is, we got particles coming off uh, the surface. So uh, let's just make these orange uh, so we can see them. Orange is red like that. And dots. Uh, click off force setting. And what do we have? So. Wherever the white is on this map, we're going to emit some particles. And now this is what's really going to kill the computer so freaking bad. Um, I'm going to go helper standard node uh, operators dynamics surface follow uh, melt particles floor node goes into the node. Yeah, this is going to be a disaster. I do not see this working. Do I have a turbo smooth on this? Oh, wait, there we go. Holy shit. We got particles on the deforming surface. Um, very cool. Uh, actually, you know what? TP does this so fucking fast. So fast. Um, oh, let's
let's put a shape on it. Uh, upper standard shape. Uh, standard shape. Just make it a sphere. That's what we need. Um, Alright, so there we go. You know. Um, and then a gravity to make them fall down. So drop in, I got a black box, dynamics, gravity, melt particles, and what do we have? There they go. So now we got particles uh, falling down the deforming surface. And I'm going to just turn on show mesh. And show mesh. So there we go. So now we got particles falling. Well, we're going to have this. So I think maybe this is too much. Um, so I turned on uh, show mesh. And so let's go. Uh, one with variation 50. And there are there is uh, particles falling down. So uh, very neat, very cool. And what I'd like to do now is uh, uh, put another surface fall uh, or trail. Sorry. Um, let's grab a melt black box. Uh, no uh, generator. Matter waves, uh, helpers, standard shape, standard shape, and you know, whenever I make trails, I always do this setup. Um, so I'm gonna go trails. Um, put them in the trails group and I have to turn coordinates off uh, per second let's go 50 so it's not freaking enormous and let's make some th trails dark red so we can see them uh, size 0 0.2 99 and what, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to actually save this as a uh, black box and mission see I don't have trails so this would be a good one to have um, save it there and I'll go exist or create and it's going to create oh shit um, we go like that and I'm going to save I'm going to save it as trails Yes, exist or create. So it's going to create a trails or use trails, and I got none, so it's going to put it to none, and now I can put it back to melt. So this uh, this thing is, uh, you know, quickly ready to go. Um, so what do I have here? I got trails uh, going down. Uh, dots. But you see, this is what's going to happen. That is what's going to happen. Kind of neat, but not what we want. We want to um, shift, drag this surface follow down, and switch this to trails. And we'll just minimize that. And there we go. And now we got, uh, I just have to turn on shape in that group and you know you could do it with a meta ball if you'd like so what do we have there you know so it, it slows down you know a heavy deforming mesh and uh, oh come on and a uh, but you know like TP can do this you know so I'm going to go to matter waves, I'm going to look at my size, I'm going to go one, uh, standard shape sphere, yeah, just click it back one, let's just let it calculate, there we go.
we go. So, you know, like, if you can metaball it, and then you have um, uh, particles over surface. So, um, I'm just going to, I think I'm going to build a preview, and uh, then I'll put it up on the site. So... Whoa, I'm recording again. Fuck. So, so I built a uh, preview to uh, double check the motion, and it was a bit, it was a bit not cool. So I'm going to copy this gravity down, and I'm going to put it into trails, and I'm going to put uh, not so high. And on here, on the um, the melting particles, I'm actually going to put a friction. Put a friction in there. 0.5, that should do. And, um, you know, and then further, further you take it to, you would, um, you'd have them break off. You'd have your particles break off uh, and go to a, uh, a different group. So and then like maybe drip and spread and I don't know maybe we'll do that we'll do that next video so that was the um you know if I, oh come on can we see what's going on here so I hate when it does that it just disappears Well, let's put uh, the gravity just a bit higher on that shit, on the red. Um, move it up, and um, 40. There we go. Yeah, the gravity had to be above, so... You know, if you metaballed, if you metaballed this, you know, you could have a probably pretty cool effect. Um, should render this out and just put a preview up on the site. So we could do it like this stuff dripping off, but um, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do is um, like you could do that, just do a test, and but I'm trying to do this quick. And the next thing will be um, from the same map will want to emit uh, fume, um, so that'll be the the next one, and uh, you know that's it. Or you know you could do fume. Maybe I won't do fume. Um, should I? Uh, if people request that, I, if you, if uh, you see this and you want uh, to con continue and see fume off this, I'll do it. But otherwise, eh. No. So just leave me a comment and uh, if. If you guys want to see fume, I will put fume on it. Um, and that's it. Thanks for watching.